In this lesson, I am going to demonstrate how you can schedule your batch epics. So basically, this example will show you the combination of batch epics with schedule epics. So in our previous lesson, I implemented one batch epics for a opportunity processor. So this is a batch epics class which is implementing database dot batchable interface and uh, here uh, we implemented start, then execute, and then finish methods. And here uh, we are querying the opportunity records and uh, like uh, all the opportunity records will be processed in uh, batches. And this will be the process that will be executed on those opportunity records. Those will be queried here. So this is basically a batch. Now, if you don't create any scheduled epics, then you need to manually execute this batch. But if you want to run your batch on daily or weekly basis automatically, so for that purpose, you can uh, basically schedule your batch epics. So what you can do, you can simply create new epics class. So uh, for example, I am labeling it as opportunity processor scheduler. And here I need to implement schedulable interface. Now inside this scheduled Apex class, I'm going to write public void execute So schedulable context and variable name is SC. And now inside this execute method. So this execute method is basically of a scheduled Apex class. Now inside this uh, execute method, you can create instance of batch Apex and you can call that. So what we can do, uh, let's say a batch class name is opportunity processor. So OPP process equals to new OPP processor. And here I can call database dot execute and I can pass this as an parameter. So this way, first I created batch Apex and then I created scheduled Apex. Inside scheduled Apex, I'm uh, calling this execute batch method of batch Apex. So now uh, from the UI, like if I schedule this, so this scheduled Apex will be executed. This execute method will be called and internally uh, this execute method will be calling uh, this execute batch method and uh, instance of opportunity processor batch Apex will be passed here as an argument. So this way you can call batch Apex into scheduled Apex and simply uh, you need to implement its test class as well. So what you need to do, you need to create the records, whatever you are processing here. And uh, after creation of records, simply you need to create instance of this opportunity processor scheduler class. And uh, you can pass uh, cron expression and uh, the instance of this opportunity uh, processor scheduler. And automatically this execute method will be run and it will internally call the batch Apex execute method. So this way, uh, in real time scenarios, whenever you create batch Apex, and if you need um, like uh, that batch should run automatically on daily or weekly basis, so you can uh, try this demonstration. 